Hi there, it's Lee here. Welcome to iMine Blocks. So in this video, I'm just going to be showing you how to mine Pascal coin using your NVIDIA graphics card. So I just updated a video showing you how to mine uh, Pascal, but it was only for AMD miners and lots of uh, NVIDIA users tried to jump on and got confused and got stuck. So in this video, I'm just going to show you how to quickly mine using your NVIDIA device. So it's part, half the same and half is a, a little bit different. So the miner that we're actually going to be using is this Volkshalk uh, Pascal Coin dash CUDA miner. Um, I'll put a link in the actual video description so you can get started with that. So that's the, the miner that we're actually going to be using. I've already uh, downloaded it and I need to remote into my other machine now. So as before, um, like I said, I'm just going to speed through this quickly um, and you'll just have to kind of fill in the detail yourself. Uh, because I don't have the time to explain every single piece to you. So you have the actual Pascal miner, uh, sorry, the actual Pascal coin wallet set up as before. So you need to create a new wallet. So I've just gone for creating a new wallet and called it demo demo. And the new keys were set for the uh, default uh, encryption, uh, just like this. So you just type demo demo default encryption. You click OK, and that's your wallet there. Close that. The next part is options, uh, miner name, demo demo, and always mine with this key, whatever account you're using. So I've got demo demo again, OK. So that's the actual wallet done. We can close that now. So the next part is the miner. So the NVIDIA miner connects via a proxy um, and then connects to the actual wallet itself. So this is um, solo mining as with the uh, AMD miner. So if you download the miner, I've just downloaded it to desktop, it's going to look something like this inside. So let me just close these uh, programs that are running. So there is a benchmarking tool. Uh, if you run the actual benchmarks, it will give you a hash rate because the actual miner doesn't produce a hash rate. So this will give you a rough idea. Um, with my GTX 970, I was getting about 200 mega hashes uh, per second, roughly. I didn't benchmark it for very long, so that's just a rough estimate. Uh, one other important thing is the, the NVIDIA drivers that I'm using are 378.49, and they're the most recent drivers, and they're the ones that I'm using with my GTX 970. Okay, so what we want to start is this Pascal Proxy V2 jar. So you need to have um, Java installed to run it. It is a Java file. So we're just going to double click and start that. So it says please enter the desired host. So the host is ourself. So it's 127.0.0.1 and the port is 4009. So this is number of GPUs. We've just got one GPU. So let's enter and the minor name demo. So it's demo uh, demo is the, the miner name and enter. Okay, so this is our proxy uh, that's actually connected to the wallet itself. And uh, now we need to start the miner to connect to the proxy, which then connects to the wallet. So it's like a three part process. So I've got this um, batch file here, uh, which is just one I created when I was trying to work something else out. So for in my instance, I've got the actual call to the actual program name. The version that I'm using is the S underscore SM52. Um, I tried the later versions and they didn't seem to work. So that is the one that I'm using uh, with my hardware. Then we've got device is zero, platform is zero, intensity is 23, and this C is for like cycles. I'm not too sure what that means. And then underneath that, we've just got pools. So that's going to be our starting batch file. So I'm just going to run that now. You can see it's got the actual device, various information about the device, uh, no errors, and then you've got this um, hash kind of uh, sequence. Um, and that's it, you're basically up and running. If I go back and just show you the miner, you'll be able to see that we're now connected to the miner. See, so miner clients, one connected JSON RPC clients. Um, so that's it, you're basically up, running, and mining with your NVIDIA devices. So that's about it. I'm sorry I sort of uh, quickly rushed through this one. Um, hopefully you've got everything you need to get up and running. Um, if you have any questions or comments, leave those in the uh, area below, the comments area, and I'll be sure to get back to you guys. Um, and um, yeah, hopefully you're up, up, and away. So until next time, guys, take care. See ya.